guys it is Arika Misha and today we're gonna be cooking spicy mustard fried shrimp you heard me y'all know I'm always cooking shrimp because we love shrimp so I figured I haven't cooked shrimp in a while so yeah let's cook some shrimp so as you guys can see I've already got my pre-cooked shrimp here in my bowl cleaned and all that uh, tail off the vein all that good stuff so I've got all my seasons here guys I'm just gonna go ahead and Pouring all my seasons, uh, letting you guys know, uh, make sure you guys can see. Sprinkling in some garlic salt, uh, sprinkling in some oil bay blackened. Get some of that in there because it is seafood. Hello, and you know what? Sometimes I use this oil bay on my chicken too. You, I mean, it's seasoned, you can put it on anything you want. All right, and let me show y'all that garlic salt I use, simple garlic salt, and my oil bay, old bay, you know, regular old bay. Sprinkle some of that in there. Okay. And I'm going to use some of my seasoning salt all over, just regular all over seasoning. I don't want to overdo it. And I've got some black pepper, ground black pepper. I'm gonna sprinkle some of that in there. Give it a little extra. And of course, you guys know, always here, star of the show, the parsley. Gonna put that parsley in there. Y'all know how I do. And we're gonna add, I have today the French yellow classic mustard. Get that open. And if you guys have never used mustard before, it's a great seasoning, you know. It's great for seasoning your meats. I use it on my chicken sometimes. Just going to put that mustard in there just like that. Just like that. And I've got some Frank's Red Hot Original Hot Sauce. Remember, these are spicy mustard fried shrimp. And we're just going to put some of that hot sauce in there like that. Going to get it all in there like that so we can have a little spice to our shrimp. Don't want to overdo it. But I do want a little spice in them. Now, if you guys want measurements, uh, one tablespoon of all your seasoning. One tablespoon. Uh, the mustard, I would say um, that would be one third a cup one third cup of mustard and the hot sauce same thing one third of uh hot sauce once again let me repeat that that's a tablespoon of your seasonings tablespoon of everything uh one third cup of hot sauce and one third cup of mustard and all i'm gonna do guys is just mix this up get it all mixed up and these are the smaller shrimp but you know what? So what? They fry just the same. Spicy mustard. Fried spicy mustard shrimp. I'm telling you, that spice and mustard together, it don't taste like mustard, mustard, you know. A lot of people think that, but mustard is a really good seasoning. It's really good on chicken, whatever meat you want to use it on, ribs, pork shrimp it really is mustard never gets that recognition but it is a wonderful wonderful season i use the mustard on my meat a lot especially when i'm marinating it overnight i didn't marinate these overnight because i wanted you guys to see how how i um seasoned them you know spicy mustard fried shrimp they are going to be so good now you can add a little chili powder or a little, you know, a little other spice, you know, something to spice it up. You can add that too, but you just want to make sure you get these all mixed up really well. Yeah, and usually I marinate overnight, let it sit overnight and cook it the next day, but I didn't do that because like I said, I wanted you guys to see how I seasoned them up. So, see what our seasons were. All right, we got those all mixed up. That looks really good. Everybody is nicely coated. 
We got enough mustard in there. We got enough hot sauce in there. Looks amazing. Let me taste it. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. It's got enough spice to it, too. Oh, that tastes good. All right. So, I will be back, and we'll be putting these in the oil to fry them up. And we're going to have these fried shrimp with some french fries, guys. I'll be back. Okay, let's get these shrimp in the oil. Let's get them fried up. You guys see I've got them lightly floured. Not too much because we don't want to lose our, uh, we don't want to lose our spicy mustard taste. So, and these little shrimp, it's not going to take much for them to get fried up. And I can fit, I pretty much, pretty much can fit all of these in here. I'm going to see how many I can fit. They're pretty small, so let me see how many I can fit in my oil. These are like the little small, not the popcorn, but medium kind of shrimp. See how many I can get in here. I'll probably have two batches. Because I've got a lot of shrimp. So this will probably be a second batch. And I want to leave them alone. I don't want to. I don't want to mess with them too much because I don't want our seasoning and our flavors to come off. So I'm gonna squeeze a little bit more in here. Don't want to crowd it too much. I think that's enough. That's a lot in there. And this second batch will be our second batch. Get my hands washed up here. Now remember, our shrimp is already cooked. These are going to fry up quickly. These are going to fry up real quick. The trick is to make sure your oil is nice and hot before you add them in. And see, they they're gonna they're gonna uh, fry up real quick, and all those seasons are all locked in there. That's why you don't want to mess with them too much. You just want to let them fry up, because you don't want to knock the season and the flour off. Just let the oil seal all that in first. Yeah, I was able to get a lot of them in here. Just checking them to see how they look. I don't want to do too much. Smells like seafood in here. We'll let them start to float a little bit. Let them float. Alright guys, we're going to go ahead and let them fry on up. And I'll be back guys to show you when I'm pulling them out. Okay guys, they are ready to come out. Let's go ahead and get them out. Let you guys get a good closer look of how they look. They look amazing. And I've got my plate here with my napkin over it. Go ahead and get them out. Don't want to over fry it. I don't want to do too much. They already small. You know how shrimp are. They shrink. So. My heat turned down some. They look good and they smell good. So good. I'm gonna get that second batch in there. I'll bring it in so you guys can see how it look, how they look. Nice. And they smell so good. They smell spicy, and you hit you smell a little hint of mustard. Oh, they smell so good, guys. So good. Mm -mm -mm. All right, let me get that second batch in while the oil is hot, guys. Know how it is dealing with hot oil. Get this second batch dropped in here. 
And these are gonna fry up even quicker because our oil is already nice and hot. You guys hear that? That oil is already nice and hot and ready. Oh yeah, she ready boy, she is ready. Calm down Gotham, calm down Gotham. Calm down. Calm down, Gotham. Calm down. Yeah, this second batch is going to cook up really fast because that oil is nice and hot. It's not going to take these long at all. See, look at that. They're already starting to brown up real quick. Almost done already. Yeah, by the time you get that second batch in, the oil is nice and hot. And it's cooking fast. Cooking them up fast, guys. Cooking them up fast. All right, we're going to let that second batch. Let me do a little taste test. Oh, my God. Oh, this so good. Mm-mm, mm-mm, mm-mm. Woo-wee. Mm-mm, mm-mm. Oh my goodness, God. That has so good. It's hot. Hot, hot, hot. You, you taste a little hint of mustard. And then you get a little burst of spiciness from the hot sauce. And then you got all your seasons in your old bag. Oh. I'm telling y'all, it's so good. Alright, y'all. I'm going to go ahead and let this second batch cook. And then I'm going to go ahead and come back and show y'all me dumping the fries in. Oh, yeah. Fried spicy mustard shrimp. And I think my fries are seasoned fries. Oh, we're really eating good day, y'all. Quick meal, quick meal. Throw it in the oil and that's it. All right, y'all. I'll be back. Okay, so we've got our second batch of shrimp out. Now it's time to drop in some seasoned fries. Yes. Yes, they look good. Everything looks good. Smells amazing. Wash my hands. Let's get these fries spread it out. Our oil is nice and hot. Get my oil back up. So those fries can get done quickly. Because the oil is hot. The oil is hot. The oil is nice and hot for those fries. Not going to take our fries long. And yes, I'm using the same oil that I fried the shrimp in. It's going to taste just fine. Your fries are not going to taste like shrimp. Nope. They're going to taste like seasoned fries. Because that's what you put in the oil. So... Don't worry about that. Yes, our shrimp tastes amazing. They taste so good. Yes, they do. Give y'all a little peek at those shrimp. Oh, 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 oh. You can see all the season. Oh. I'm telling y'all, so good. All right, let's get prepared for our fries to come out because they are going to get done quickly because this oil is hot. So let me get another plate prepared with napkins to take the fries out.
quick and easy. And one thing I don't do, I just let my fries cook. I, you, you stir them up, they get all soggy and they start breaking. So I just want to make sure they're all down in the oil. All down in the oil and I just leave my fries alone. I just leave them alone. They let them cook. You ain't got to babysit them and keep flipping them, tossing them all around. Nope. You break them up, they get all soggy, you just leave them alone. I let my fries fry up and get all nice and brown. And once they start floating, that's when I just go ahead and toss them around a little bit, you know. Toss them around a little bit and then they should be done. Okay guys, when I come back, I will be pulling the fries out. I already have my fries out and I'll be showing you guys the final results. Alright guys, we'll be back. Okay, it's time for those fries to come out. We'll show y'all they are nice and brown. Nice and golden brown, guys. Got my stove off. Mm 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 mm. The smell of the fried shrimp and the potatoes, the fries smell like roasted potatoes. Oh my goodness, it smells so good. Nothing like some fries cooked in the oil. Ain't nothing like it. See if I can take y'all that way for better light. There it is. Bringing them in for y'all. Bringing them in. And these are public season fries, guys. So good. Look at them. Yes. So good. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So good. Let me taste one. Let me just taste and see. You know. Hot, hot, hot. Woo! That's hot. Mm. Oh my God, that's so good. And they the season fries. Oh my God, they're so good. ASMR. Hot, hot. Mm. Whew, hot, hot, hot. Mm, all right. Okay. Y'all see the fries. I got them right there in y'all face. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, 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 y'all. Okay. Let's see. Let me go and get these shrimp. Go ahead and end this video. So I can stop torturing y'all. All right, there's our fries. Zoom in on our fries, guys. Let me go get the shrimp. And there's our shrimp. All right, there's the fries. Y'all seen them, taking y'all in. Woo wee. Let's get back there to the shrimp back there. Let me zoom y'all out a little bit. Ooh wee. Nice. Spicy mustard shrimp. Taking y'all in. Come on. He'll figure it out. Come on, hit your eye. All right. Here we go. All right, guys. You seen me do it, so you know I did it. Our fried spicy mustard shrimp. And our seasoned french fries guys oh my goodness i gotta go because i'm ready to eat y'all seen me do it so y'all know i did it because i recorded it y'all saw me doing it so you know i did it <laughs> all right guys don't forget to like comment and subscribe follow me on all my social media at arika misha guys and don't forget knowledge is power all right y'all bye